hello guys welcome to my channel and in this video i'll be showing you how to stream to multiple youtube channel at the same time using obs so without further ado let's get started so now the first thing you want to do is to go to your browser i'm just going to open my safari it could be chrome just open your browser and then just search so i'm just going to search for a plugin we need to download the plugin so i'm going to search oh i've got it here so now if you are doing that for the first time just go to google.com google.com and search for obs rtmp plugin so it's going to open click on the first option click on go to download and it's going to bring you to the GitHub account. Don't worry about all these languages you are seeing here. Just scroll down, and where you are going is this side here. We are almost there. We are almost there. I think I've passed by it. I just passed by it. Yeah, yeah. Here, this is it. Under her sets, now you want to click on. I'm using a MacBook, so I'm going to download the Mac OS Universal. I already have that installed so if you are using windows just click on this and linux you click on this and then you just install it the same way you install every other software now after installing the software come back to obs you might need to close your obs and open again so now and you might not see any significant change when after installing the software uh, the plugin rather after installing the plugin you might not see any significant change what you have to do is to come to dock right here and click on multiple outputs so now it's going to load up the plugin right here now the first thing we want to do now is to the next thing we want to do rather is to set up the our first youtube account so i want to go to stream and connect the first YouTube account. Now I'm going to click on, you know, you might have custom right here as the default. Now you just need to click on it and click on YouTube RTMP and click on connect account. So if you already have your account logged in on the browser, once you click on connect, it's going to log load the account you have right um, on that browser and what you want to do is to select the youtube account or youtube channel that you want to stream to so now i'm going to click on this first one i've got two of them here i'm going to click on this first one because i've got two channels on this particular email address so the first one i'm going to click on the first one so then i'm going to con connect continue yeah so authorization complete so if i go back to obs you see that the account is already connected you see my name right here the account connected you can see my name right here the account is connected so the next thing i want to do is i click ok now okay that is done now the next thing is to connect the second YouTube account and that's where this plugin comes in. Now what you want to do is to click on add new targets and you want to call, you want to give it a name, let's say YouTube, you might want to name it, uh, give it the name of the second YouTube account. So for the second YouTube account, uh, you, let me just call it second YouTube account. You can call it whatever name you like second youtube account and you need to add the url and then the stream key so in order to get this right here we want to go log into the youtube account now if you have two channels on a particular account just like i have two channels on my email address um what you just need to do is just to switch the account so for example if i come over to youtube here and i click on this 
and I go to youtube.com so go to YouTube here so just let's just give it a moment to load up now if we click on this option right here you will see switch account so once you click on switch account I've got two accounts right here I've got this and I've got this other one so this first one is the one I connected at first why let's say I want to stream to this second one so I, what I just need to do is just to switch to this other account and if you are streaming to um, a different account um, that is not connected on the same page it's just the same process so you just have to log in or just go to a new profile just click on these three dots here if you are using Chrome just go to profile and then just add new profile add a new profile and then log into the account then just go to youtube and follow the same process now having switched the account i'm going to click on create and then go live so once that is done i i'm going to wait for it to load up all right so now if you look right here you give it the title you give it whatever thing you want to give it i'm just going to leave it on unleashed now because i don't want it to go out it's just like a test stream just for the sake of this tutorial now these are the things you need number one this is the stream key and this is the stream url so i'm going to copy copy the stream url then go to obs then paste the stream url right here then secondly i will go back again I will copy the stream key your stream key just make sure it's safe it's not exposed keep it safe that's why it's secured right here now what you need to do is just to copy the stream key just click on copy then you go back to your OBS and paste in the stream key if you want to view it which is not necessary just click on this button or this icon right here now the next thing you want to set right here is you want to enable this sync start with obs which means once you trigger start streaming right here once i click start streaming and it starts streaming to the second channel it will immediately start streaming to this channel as well however if you don't want to start streaming at the same time let's say uh, your event is two hours and you probably want to start streaming to the second account maybe after an hour so make sure you disable this so that when is time for you to stream let's say after an hour that you are ready to stream to the second channel you will just come back here and just click on start do you understand however if you have this enabled right here if you sync start with obs and sync stop with obs it means once you trigger once you click on this start streaming it will immediately trigger this as well and start streaming to this channel if you trigger stop streaming it's going to stop the both of them at the same time however if you want them to be independent of each other make sure you just disable these options right here all right so having done that I, I think i'm just going to leave it as enable then these settings here i just wanted to take whatever settings you should share the same settings with what i have inside of obs now just leave every other thing the same now click on ok now i have a video right here that will be playing so that you know that something is going live so i'm going to play this media right here okay yeah i'm going to play the media right here so now can you see second youtube account and you know the beautiful thing is you can add another youtube account so you can add new target again if you have another youtube account you had it but just make sure you have a very strong internet um, connection very strong one so that it doesn't start dragging things slowing things down and all of that so um so that's that so i haven't set up this second youtube account you you want to go back to your other youtube 
so this is the second youtube account you know you've got all things set up make sure you set up all things if you want to make changes come over here and make your changes let's say you want to add a cover you might give them different cover designs if you want to give them a different cover designs you can do that you can give this a different cover design and then you want to come back to remember we've not set up um, the stream for the first account so i'm going to click on manage broadcast i will create a new broadcast i will call it my broadcast test let me say zero one just since it's a test um broadcast now the next thing is um no it's not made for kid you set the category if it's education you set maybe with that education then you click the thumbnail to add thumbnail i think i'm just going to add um I think I've got one thumbnail here for my previous tutorial. So I'm just going to scroll down to one of my thumbnails here. I'm just going to click open. So I've got this right here. Then I will click on create broadcast. So it's going to create the broadcast. And once it's set, we are good to go. Okay. So let's wait for that to load up now we have our broadcast set up for the first account and we have our broadcast set up for the second account we are logging to uh in the obs here we are logging to the first account and right here at the multi output plugin we are logging to the second account and don't forget if you want to add the third account click on add new target and you add that right there is this is the same thing for if you want to add a facebook account just add the same process all right so having done that i can then click on start streaming immediately I click on start streaming let's watch what happens uh, so that we can follow we can monitor it let me open the second account as well you know this is the second account let me open the first account the one that has um this other youtube yeah the first one we authorized so let me open it so that we'll be sure uh, a stream is going on so i'm going to open that and i'm going to go to um uh, view view my channel and i want to go to live all right this live then i will come back here to obs and click on start stream immediately i click on start stream you see it triggered this other one immediately so it starts streaming to this and it starts streaming to the second account. So let's check them out. Now, this is the second account. You can see the video is showing right here. Can you see? The video is here. Let's go to the first account. The first account is here. Let me just refresh this. I'm going to refresh. Can you see? We are live. Can you see this live? So if I click on it now, you can see it's live it's live right here and if i go back to my obs let me switch things up so you know i have this here let me switch it to this image so that you know that's it's really working now i have the image here so if i just can you see the image is right here for the second account and here as well let's see what happens here oh sorry i'm dragging that too far can you see yeah so this is also working right here so it's pretty easy and once you're done streaming you can just click on stop here and it's going to stop this as well remember we enable the sync with obs so once i click on stop so and i click yes it's going to stop this and stop both of them at the same time so it's quite simple. That's simply how to stream to multiple YouTube channels at the same time. I hope you find this video helpful. If you find it helpful, don't forget to give me a like, give me a follow, subscribe to this channel. It's completely free. And click on the notification bell to get notified whenever I upload a new video. Thank you for staying this far. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.